Hello everybody, uh, it is Will. Um, <clears throat> I am currently cooking. Uh, water is boiling now um, on the side of the road. Uh, I'm in a little divot. Um, I have some friends over here. Oh, they're approaching. Whoa, look. Dang, that's crazy. <laughs> I didn't expect them to come up. And I have a nice little river right here. Um, look, at, look at him. Look at that guy. Uh, yeah, there's a super old like bridge here. It's kind of cool. Um, yeah. Anyways, um, so I'm going to tell you about my day yesterday. Um, went over a ton of mountains. Nothing but sheep. Uh, very steep and very long, but I, uh, you know, I prevailed, I did it, um, I had some good moments, I finished The Hobbit, um, now I'm gonna download The Lord of the Rings probably and listen to that next time I have Wi-Fi, um, but <clears throat> at the end of the day, um, I was kind of out of water, and I wasn't gonna get to the next town for another entire day, so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ask somebody if there's like a local pub, I was in the middle of nowhere, middle of nowhere. Um, and they were like, oh yeah, it's just on the road. And so I walked like three more miles and found it just at the end of the road. And, um, so I went there and the guy was like really strange, like very, very weird vibes. And it was like, he was like, I, originally I was going to ask if I could like pitch up my tent there. And he was like joking about like, he's just weird. He's just a weird guy, bad vibes, bad vibes. And he lived there at the pub. Uh, he was the owner and he took me out back and was like, oh yeah, you can pitch your tent up here or you can have a room upstairs. But, uh, he brought me out back and like, it was kind of a dump and he had emu, like ostriches. I know they're different animals, but he had like ostriches and baby ostriches and like three peacocks. And one of the peacocks was albino and, uh, like so many cats this is weird this weird this weird vibes i don't know and i was like hi yeah okay man so i hung out i charged all my stuff and then i quietly slipped into the night and i just pitched a tent in a local field like right next to his place that he couldn't see me um so anyways uh just keep keep uh keep your wits about you if you're traveling because my my rule of thumb is if a guy offers me a place to stay i don't stay there unless he has a family because if it's just like a single dude, then okay, that could be like a Ted Bundy situation. You know what I mean? But if it's like, a, if he's got like a family, a wife and kids, then he's fine. Um, so anyways, all right, I'm safe. I survived the night. Um, going to Fermoy today. Uh, I'm making good headway. Making good headway. Anyways, all right, that's all. I am, water's boiling. I'm going to pour it into the noodles now.